Howdy Brewers. We finally got the yeast comparison for the lager we made. S23 to my left and M76 to my right. So it's a saf lager versus a mangrove jacks yeast. The grain bill was simple. It was all it was all pills the malt with uh, some Halatau hops. Let's see the pores. So these were both batch primed and also I added the yeast that you saw in a previous video. Now the glass is a bit chilled, so we'll get a bit of a bit of uh, haziness. So here's the S23. There's M76. Looks like the same beer. Let's have a have a whiff. The S23 definitely has some estuary estuary notes. Yeah, de definitely has uh, has some esters there, and. I get a little bit of um, grain aroma, malt aroma from the M76. Let's give them a taste. So that one has a bit of, um, uh, what would you call it? A bit of a, it's, it's a clean flavour. Um, it's a bit, a bit, more bitter than I would have expected because I only took these beers to 20 IBUs just because I wanted to compare the yeast and I didn't want the hops to um, play too much of a factor in it. Okay, so uh, M76 definitely has a has a more malty flavour than uh, the S23. Yeah, there's definitely um, more malty maltiness to that yeast. Yeah, the the S23 um, it it has more flavours, um, but not um, not any grain like flavours like the M76. They're both they both um, I'm perceiving the same level of bitterness from each beer. Definitely. Um, in terms of which one I prefer, uh, the the malt multi richness I'm getting from the M76 um, is a, a nicer flavour on the mouth today. Yeah, there's almost like a bit of um, cloying sweetness to the S23. So um, after. Brewing these, I brewed this beer um, about, oh geez, would have been close to almost three months ago now. Um, I did do a video of it um, and yeah, split the batch, added the S23 and the M76. Here's a, here's a graph of how, um, how the yeasts actually performed. It's a, as you can see, the um, S23 got off to a, a ripper of a start, and then uh, they caught each other on about day 10, day 12 um, for gravity, and then they ended on exactly the same gravity. So there you have it. If you like your malty beers, um, or malt flavors, malt forward flavored beers, and you're doing a lager, I would go with the M76 um, but if you want to try something a little bit different the S23 is definitely a tasty tasty yeast and if you like your esters it's um, a fine performing yeast. Cheers! <laughs>